So what's this proposal all about? Well, the Environmental Committee is proposing that our co-op no longer distribute free plastic roll bags and instead make them available for a purchase at a cost of 20 cents per bag. The Park Slope Food Co-op has an environmental policy that says, in short, we will try to do as little damage as possible to our planet. Our overuse of plastic roll bags violates this policy, period. Every piece of plastic ever made still exists today and will exist forever. Why? Because it doesn't biodegrade. Instead, it just breaks into smaller pieces as it leaches and bioaccumulates toxins and permeates every corner of our Earth. Despite having the image of cleanliness, plastic is dirty. Research has shown that nearly all plastic, even that which claims to be BPA-free, releases chemicals that have estrogenic activity, causing hormone disruption and contributing to the dramatic increase in chronic health problems, especially in children. The majority of polyethylene feedstock produced for our co-op's plastic bags is made from natural gas, and some natural gas is obtained by fracking. Fracking, as some of you might have heard, threatens our food and water supply and has been known to ruin farmlands and farmers. Our co-op supports the anti-fracking renewable energy movement, but by using so many plastic bags, we are actually increasing the demand for fracking. Our plastic consumption and convenience culture affects not only our community, but also the families living near and working in industry plants. These communities suffer from abnormally high asthma and disease rates. Plastic pollutes the ocean. Plastic polymers currently contribute up to 90% of the waste floating in the oceans. And unlike glass and metal, plastic is not effectively recycled. Now, some may say that these changes are impossible, and we disagree. We feel it underestimates our members' resilience and their commitment to the environment. With a little creativity and courage, we can change our habits. Will there be a period of adjustment? That is entirely up to us. So, a small implemented charge on bags could be a big change for the city we love. Did you know that on March 1st, 2014, right here in New York City, school groups and environmental advocates will host a day of activities and seminars to help coach other students on how to share their voices and opinions in front of the New York City Council on the critical decision to place a charge on all plastic and paper carryout bags. Several other cities have put this action into effect, creating a permanent shift in consumer behavior. And by reducing plastic bag use, reduce the amount of plastic bags that end up in our trees and waterways and preserving our precious resources. The Environmental Committee believes that the downsides of plastic bag use far outweigh the benefits, and therefore we feel that a change is warranted. Here's what we can do. Our co-op will no longer distribute free plastic roll bags and instead make them available for purchase at a cost of 20 cents per bag. Ensure a wide selection of low-cost, lightweight, reusable roll bag alternatives. Improve floor signage and access to reusable bags. Encourage our fellow members to reuse plastic bags already taken from the co-op and elsewhere. Provide educational activities and communications to help each other with the transition, if help is needed. The Park Slope Food Co-op is a role model to other food co-ops around the world. A French production company is currently making a feature documentary about us. Our example matters. Our actions resonate in a wider world. This change will not only positively affect our local community, but it'll inspire action everywhere. We can do this.